beloved, we are gathered here today, honey, tribute, NASCAR, and to say goodbye to all the things you see before you. Welcome, my friends. Welcome to another Aimless Adventure coming to you from the NASCAR Cafe, Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. And all of this could be yours for the low, low price of whatever it sells for at auction. I think it's time we explore more. This place has been abandoned for 10 years, so there's a little bit of black mold creeping on you. Let's do it. Now, we're creeping around today. This is take a peek day. And then tomorrow is gonna to be the auction. So this is the old main room right here where you'd get your fixings on. And then down this way, that's where the memorabilia is at. Let's go take a look. You could get you a Winston Cup, which actually is pretty collectible because they don't call it that anymore because smokes. Or you can just buy a booth. Life's a race. Sometimes you crash. Like this place. Hey, do you want fries with that shake? I, I think this. I think this restaurant's been closed for for ten years. I what are you what are you doing, what are you even doing back here? Uh, Bunch of wall trip stuff. Some Dale Sr. That other guy that wore that color. A whole bunch of shirts. I wonder this. This almost looks like it was an old piece of merchandise and not something that was hung on the wall. I don't know what driver that is, but more importantly, there's a Mr. Peanut right there. So, bro, you here for the auction? Oh, he is the auction. In the garage area, big dedication to Bobby Allison. The theming's pretty good, but I don't know if they intended that. Uh, yeah, those aren't oil stains. That's that's mold. Let's see what we can scope out over here. Whoa! Check this out. What is that? Trophy from Bristol, 1984. That's pretty sweet. If you know who won Bristol in 84, April of 84, let me know. I don't see it anywhere on there. There's another one from Bristol. And uh, Winston Cup. So that's, that's pretty collectible. The Food City 500. It must be an old merch case right there. I've had a handful of tires that look like this, but uh, that's because I was uh, too cheap to buy new ones. This is what I was looking for, but there are no logos on these plates. Well, it's kitchen I think I might be in line for this cutting board. It comes with salmonella at no extra charge. I was really hoping to score a mug with a NASCAR logo, but not gonna happen. Looks like we got some random helmets over here.
Check this out. From my old neck of the woods, Daytona. There's uh, Ron and Nancy Reagan. Now, actually, scratch that. That is not Nancy. It may be Tanya Tucker. I'm not quite sure. If you know, let me know. But that's definitely hey, how are you doing? Ron Reagan. So Jimmy Spencer signed that. Smoking Joe's. Because nothing says NASCAR more than overpriced chicken wings. Check out that pace car from the 60s. A younger king chilling with the ladies. There's Brenda Lee. Check out that sweet Coke sign. Who's on this? That's pretty sweet. You got different drivers on there. Check this out. It's a little while. Uh, Cut away of an engine. They don't smell like Daryl Waltrip. Come to think of it, I don't even know what Daryl Waltrip smells like, or nor, do, nor do I want to know. I think I just got black mold. All right, so we didn't score anything because there's no auction today, but I did pick up one of these. That's an official program for the auction, which we bought nothing at, and you can get it for no charge. As a matter of fact, if you want, Jacob and I will personalize it. Um, we can't put a name because we don't know who's going to win it, but yeah, so uh, I don't know. I'll do that random comment picker thing, and somebody will get this, and uh, you can see what they sold a couple weeks ago. That's it. Bye.